really small space and we have lifted it out of the doldrums. When I came over, I was shocked at how drab the room really was. Your typical add-on sunroom. You had exposed brick, you had a low ceiling, you had, you know, older ceiling fans. All the finishes were pretty tired. The carpet was an indoor-outdoor commercial grade in a dark green. When I met with the client originally, she said she really wanted it to look um, peaceful. She wanted it to feel peaceful and serene. She really wanted it to be sort of an escape. When I think about doing rooms like this, I think of keeping everything light and airy. I think of the overall effect as being almost in soft focus. And so I think of color, so that made me think of like blue, that would reference the sky outside, reference the color of the water of the pool. So I used it as a very subtle accent in the room. There's a touch of blue in the window treatment, and then I accented the ceiling to be blue. The trick we use in design is when we have a small room to run the floor on the diagonal. This helps to skew the walls and push them out so that the rooms feel larger. We played a couple of times with how to lay this floor out. And I met with the tile designer and we laid out a couple of options. And the whole idea with laying the floor on the diagonal was to make, to push the walls out. But I feel like now that I've got it laying out here, my eye's going straight into that corner instead of away from the corner. Mm -hmm. So what do you think? Why don't we turn it the other way? I think it would uh, open up the room. Oh my gosh, it looks so much better that way. Totally. That was a great idea. Now the wall's actually pushing out. I did put two large rugs down to just sort of create two different conversation areas. One where I've set up a mock breakfast table. The idea here is that I could read from the wing chair, but I could also turn the chair very easily and have a light breakfast or coffee in the morning. The other area was really more for reading, which the client had requested. Um, she had wanted an area where she could curl up with a book and have her dogs nearby and be able to look out at the pool because they do really enjoy the pool. So everything that I did in this room, setting up the, the furniture, was, was to focus and highlight the pool, which is important to the family. She called me when she saw the room and she said, Eric, I don't just like it. I love it. See, it always makes me feel good. Those are really the moments I live for with my work is when they call I'm so excited about their project. A lot of times the client can't see what I can see, which is the finished product. And so when they give me their trust to do for them what I know they're gonna love in the end, those are the most fulfilling projects.